the takeoff, and you could see when he when he took the first dribble, the crossover, you could tell he's getting his feet together to go punch that home. Dribble in here, Matthews got a hand on it. Hauser left alone in the corner. Count it. And that's what happens when you move the basketball. You move. Again, the shot clock at two. Forrest, the floater goes. And Fernando back. And he was questionable coming in. Matthews bats it out. Murray, floater on point. Drew, that, that, that's effort, Drew. Yeah. Tatum plus the foul. Play. Tatum gets good position. Can't finish though. Crate in the spin around. And that is a foul. That's a foul. Love it. Luke Cornett with a great pass on time on target. 38%. Hawks 11 of 35. 31%. Tatum rolls in the free throw. He's out of it. Couldn't finish over Porzingis. Out to White. You know he wants to push the pace. Finds JT for the stuff. The matchup we highlighted off the top. Former Spurs teammate Murray over White. That's a tough shot. How about this, Bogdanovich, who I managed to jinx so. Okay, yes, I will blame you too. So let's jinx him right here. What is it, 91%? 91%. Four for four. Brown with a nice catch. Out to White for three. Inside, outside basketball, Drew. Tatum against Bogdanovich. Five on the timer. Tatum fires and hits. Little space, hits the three. You did that. Tatum playing bully ball. Got his own, laid it in. Just too big. Fortunate fouls at the end of the shot clock. Tatum strips it, gets free. Just a little bit overzealous right there, trying to block. Shot clock winds down to five. Brown eyes up, Hunter shoots over him and drops it in. A hand to the face, made Murray miss the triple. Another offensive rebound. Bogdanovich ties the game with a triple. Under five seconds left. Tatum got a fire, shoots. We go to overtime. One of the best offensive rebounding teams in the league, led by the top offensive rebounder in Clint Capella. Porzingis switched on to Murray, who's been jacking tonight. Does it again and scores. He's got to a sweet spot. He walked Porzingis down, put Porzingis on his heel, and he for 14 tonight, 16 points. Defending Murray here. He's been stalking him every time he draws that assignment. Now Porzingis with the switch. They expect Murray to attack. He's elite from the mid-range, and he hits another. Now Tatum, dribble drive, count it, plus the harm. Well, let's get some. JT, now nine for 10 at the free throw line tonight, 29 points. Every single time. He got it again. Murray switched on to Porzingis. No help. Murray puts him in the mixer and hits another jumper. Three straight baskets, three straight times. White knocks down the triple. I think we got an issue with the scoreboard here. Yep, 119. Celtics take the lead again. What a night for Derek White from outside the arc. Murray, of course he's going to shoot that. Of course he's going to make it. He's taken 41. Look, just being smart, using your body. Just being pump fake. Pogo stick. It's a good look. <laughs> 26 years old. Putting it work. Blitz the free throws. One point game. Now almost killing us, just unlucky with the bounces right here. But look at D. White never giving up on his play. Tying up West Matthews. We have.
White the trigger man. Finds Porzingis, matched up with Capella. Thought about taking the mid-range jumper, bounces it to JB. He forces it over, Matthews! Splash! One stop. Pritchard guards Matthews on the inbound. No five-second violation. Hawks with a chance. It's Murray against Holiday. Knocks it down. Well, just the third time all season the Celtics lose back-to-back -back games. And that is a disappointing trip.